Hi, and welcome back to Port. What's good, YouTube? Welcome back to another video. On today's video, we got a banger Tech 9 video for you guys. Look, I'm gonna be honest, I'm so surprised they have this as a pistol and not a primary. This gun is, I don't know, broken as shit. It definitely should not be categorized as a pistol. This shit is like a mini SMG. But then let's get into the class setup and I'll show you guys how to set it up. Alright, starting off, we're gonna start with the Rebel HK Underbearer. Now, what this is going to do is going to give us that hip fire accuracy, hip fire recoil, hip fire uh, recoil steadiness, and aim walking steadiness. Now, what we want to do here for the tunings is tune for ADS and tune for hip walking. So, if you're walking while you're not aimed in, you're going to be moving a lot faster. Somebody jumps out in front of you, you can like straight back and forth and aim in fast. Um, this is going to help with the recoil also. That's why it's the only attachment that gives you recoil steadiness because this gun does shoot crazy as shit. It, the recoil on this is nasty you're gonna need some type of grip to control the recoil stadium next we got the ratchet be this barrel is gonna do the maximum damage out of all the other six barrels i think there is you're gonna get a damage range increase a hip fire accuracy increase and a bullet velocity main two things we're focusing on is the damage range and the bullet velocity that's what we're definitely gonna need so what we want to do is tune max out recoil steadiness and we're gonna max out damage range because this is still categorized as a pistol so you want to kind of get the most damage you can out of this next we got the cronin mini pro personally i like to have a sight on it i don't like the iron sights but you can rock the iron sights there's nothing wrong with them i use it trying to level up the gun me personally i just don't like it for warzone but if you don't want to rock iron sights you can probably put on a rear grip to help with more ads or a little bit more recoil control but i'm using that slide for a sight the next attachment we're going to be rocking is the ftac folder now with this is going to be plus crouch movement speed recoil control sprint speed and aim and stability we really want recoil control and sprint speed uh make us a lot faster and then like i said earlier this gun just shoots up when it comes to recoil so we definitely want something that's going to help with the recoil control and we don't really lose too much we just lose sprint to fire but it's a pistol it's going to have decent sprint to fire anyway but we're going to max tune out aim walking speed like i said earlier so if somebody's in your uh face if you're aimed in you get straight back and forth easy and you're going to tune for aim down sight speed because we're going to need this as fast as possible if we're going to be running it as a secondary lastly i'm rocking the 50 round i highly suggest you rock the 50 round if you want more ammo <clears throat> to rock the 72 round but for the 50s because the default mag on this gun this gun is not strong enough to take out multiple people once with one mag with 30 round bullet so you might want to put on the 50 get the extra 20 rounds uh but personally if you want to rock the 50 or the 72 i do recommend rocking at least some type of mag that's going to give you more ammo but than that hope you guys do enjoy the video don't forget to like comment and subscribe and shout out to the people that commented on the last video Fucking weirdo. Hello viewers, but like it's not as much as it used to be. Running fucking high. Yeah, but I'd rather do it in a rank because I get rewarded for doing it. Come here, little bitch. The daddy talked to you. Forward 18. It's just so fucking ratty. Like people are running high more in the daytime. Oh, 
Run, please. Oh my god. Oh, this kid know I have a pistol and I will let this bitch rip on his ass. <laughs> 